guys, welcome to Flapjacks. In Gallenberg, Tennessee. Right off 321. Yeah, and uh, it's kind of across from, uh, was that Brookside over there? Yes. And there's a uh, Hungry Bear Barbecue right here beside it. Mm -hmm. Yep. So we're gonna go in, give it a try. I'm not a huge pancake lover. And if you watch this channel, you know, um, biscuits and gravy for me. But Karen loves pancakes and I like, I like them. I just, not my first choice. Right, but they might have other breakfast food. Yeah. So we're gonna go in and let you know what we think about it. Come along with us.
Okay, finished up. Flapjacks. Here, Gallon Bird. Yes, and you know what? We didn't eat everything. No. So I'm glad somebody had the brilliant idea to share the Park Buster breakfast. <laughs> she did. But um, man, it was good. It was really good. Mm -hmm. We can go through everything with you, but um, the sausage link we thought was really good. We, we actually liked it better than the patty. Yep. Had the patty was flavor. good. Yeah. Yeah. And the scrambled eggs were good, really good. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see what else was there. The oh. hash brown casserole was good because it was cheesy, but it had too many onions in it for my taste. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I didn't try any of, any of those. Don't really like. Well, anyway, didn't try that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see what else. I had country ham and it was delicious. The country ham was. And you were good. saying you haven't had country ham in a long time. Yeah, I, I haven't. Um, but it was good. Okay, so everybody wants to know what you thought about the gravy. Oh yeah, gravy and biscuits. All right, so um, it's hard to tell. Probably a mix, but <laughs> had um, real sausage mixed in with it. So it was it was good. It was it was good. I would come back and eat it again. Okay. Yeah. What about the pancakes? Pancakes were good. I thought you had yep. some. <laughs> yep, they were they were good. Like I said, I don't know anything about pancakes. A pancake is a pancake. You can get them thicker, you can get them thinner. Yeah. But, um... Well, it depends on... You can get them, and they're more fluffy, and these were good. Okay, the bacon was good. Overall, a, a good meal. It you, was. Uh, you want to tell everybody it was how much it was? It was $15.99 for the Barn Buster breakfast that we shared, and Mike's Coke soft drink was $2. Or something like that. I mean, unbelievable. $21. Mm -hmm. Not counting tip. Yeah, not counting tip. For our meal right here in Gallenberg, I, I'd definitely do that again. Yes, and we bought some souvenirs. We yep. bought yep. one of their coffee cups. Yeah, Flapjack coffee cup. Overall, it was a great, it was a great experience. Neat atmosphere. And our waitress was really good. Yeah, Very friendly. Server. server was great. Yep. Mm -hmm. It was, um, it was crowded, you could see in there, but yes. any place on a breakfast morning here in Gatlinburg on the weekend is going to be that way. It is, so we would come back here. I think I would, would you? Yep, absolutely. Hey, Mike, I didn't want to tell everybody about yeah. the curtains. Oh. Yeah. I thought the curtains in every booth are really neat. Um, they had like a camping theme on them, like old time campers, like old time tent, and yeah. you could see back of a guy with a hat on okay. and canoes and elk and deer yep. and landscaping it was really cool yeah and uh flapjacks pancake cabin so thanks for coming along they for have, this review yeah they have several locations one is Sevierville and uh, other places you can look them up but that's our review here in Gatlinburg off 321 yep. with Fridays forever bye bye guys uh, see you next time